Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for coming back for another motivational cleaning video. This is part two of the last cleaning video I did of my room and bathroom. I clean my room and bathroom often, so it's not that bad, but it does get really dusty in here, so I like to keep it clean. I try to stay on top of my bathroom, especially the shower because it's a pain to clean and it's huge. The same with the tub and toilet. My vanity area and the floors are the worst since this is where I do my hair and makeup every day. To start, I'm going to dust my bed frame, then change the sheets and make my bed. And if you're wondering, my bed is from Ikea and my bedding is from Target. You say all the right things when I'm hurting. You always pick me up when I am down It's like you have a spark that leaves me burning You just have your ways to get me high You make all my dreams come true It feels right When I'm around you We could break up and then make up I always come back to you You move So I'm guilty of eating in bed and watching TV. It's a really bad habit, I know, but I don't plan on stopping anytime soon. That's why I have a mattress protector. But anyway, before anyone asks, this is Soy Sauce Girl. My sheets are patterned. I didn't see it until I took the fitted sheet off. The amazing Whippet got it right out, of course. I love this stuff. These sheets I'm about to put on the bed are my favorite. They're from Target. I think they're the Threshold brand. They're a jersey knit material, I think, and they just hug the mattress so nicely. There's hardly any ripples in it. They're super soft and they're really inexpensive too. You guys should try them out. I used to have a bunch of them at the old house for my queen size bed, but now that I have a king, this is the first um, set that I've bought so far, but I'm definitely gonna be getting more in different colors. Do you guys remember those Serta pillows that I got from Sam's Club? They were like $9.98 for two of them and I loved those pillows, but I had them for over two years so it's time for them to go. Well, I got new ones from Sam's Club and they were just, they were so bad. I couldn't find those ones again. So I ordered these ones from Target and they're not exactly what I was looking for. And plus these don't look king size. They look standard to me, but I did order new ones and they're actually king size and they're cool gel um, memory foam ones so good i cannot wait to tell you guys more about them i've tried sometimes but you're making me nervous no i've realized that i can't live without you 
not used this throw blanket in such a long time but I felt like it would match with the pillows that I had on the bed right now and plus I want to switch out this um, accent chair in my room I want to use it at my vanity now I've been looking at Wayfair and Target but I haven't really found anything that I like yet I know the cable cords dangling under the TV is just unsightly and not it. I do have the cable covers, but with my experience using them at the old house, it destroyed the walls when we took them off. And from what I read, it wasn't supposed to, and we're renting here, so I just don't want to do that again. After cleaning the mirror, the last thing I have to do in here is vacuum and then we're moving on to the bathroom. So into my bathroom, I'm going to do a semi deep clean. I need to tidy it up and clear off the vanity, wipe it down, clean the mirrors and the sinks. I'm also going to be cleaning the inside of the tub because that's where I still give the kids a bath. 
uh, my shower doors I just went ahead and wiped them down with some rubbing alcohol to clean them the inside wasn't really dirty because like I said I keep up with cleaning my shower and it's usually while I'm in there because it's so big and hard to keep up with In the water closet, I'm going to spray the toilet down with some bleach, but first, I normally don't do this. I'm using these disinfecting wipes to clean the area on the floor because I just don't like walking around in there. The kids sometimes use this bathroom and things get messy. I'm going to vacuum the floors and then wipe down the cabinet tree and clean off the baseboards before mopping.
You guys know I normally don't use my steam mop in the bathroom, especially not around the toilet area. Even though it's already disinfected, I just don't like doing that. But my little Rubbermaid mop, the pads were all dirty. I know cleaning fail. So I just went ahead and used my steam mop. I'm using one of the blue cloths that I use to buff my toilets to clean the floor, which is some alcohol because I didn't feel like going to get my vinegar mix, but it's fine. This also disinfects. That is it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll make more like this. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you all in my next video.